Hello everyone and welcome to my channel! This week I have decided to continue working on Disney Princess dolls and our model of this week will become this Ariel doll. This doll is a little bit difficult for me because the Ariel character from the Disney story is something completely different than the Little Mermaid from the original fairy tale of Hans Christian Andersen. And the Disney story is all funny and cartoonish, especially in the series, but it's very, very far from the original story that is extremely sad and after reading it as a kid you are crying the whole evening. And here we have such a happy young lady, you see. But I like her red hair and the shape of her face looks funny, it's so sharp and she looks like a fish a little bit, so I would forget about the amazing sad story about the Little Mermaid and just work with what we have today and let's try to make her at least a little bit more realistic and alive. I will start like always with removing her clothing and protecting the doll body and hair from the sealant that I will use for my repaint. Then I remove her original makeup with pure acetone and seal her face with three layers of Mr. Super Clear sealant. And then I take my watercolor pencils and sketch her eyes. For the eyebrows I use like usually soft pastels and then I shape them with a piece of an eraser. And then I start contouring her face. First I take such a very light brown pastels and contour her eye crease, the sides of her nose, the cheeks and also the area around her mouth. Then I take a little bit darker brown pastels and make all the shadows deeper. And this is my favorite step in the whole repainting process. 
when they just sketch the doll's eyes with a pencil. It of course doesn't look very special and on the very early stage of my every doll repaint, I doubt myself if it's gonna look good in the end. But when I do the contouring, I already start seeing a human face in a rubber doll and then I know that everything is gonna be okay. Now I want to make her skin tone less contrast brown and for this I apply a layer of light pink pastels on top. Then her face color will look more healthy. And this trick perfectly works on human faces as well. Just a little bit of blush on your cheeks will immediately make her look more fresh and healthy. Then I come back to my pencils and start working on her eyes more detailed. I think the makers of the original Barbie dolls stopped their paintwork approximately here somewhere at this step, but we still have a lot to do. And for her eyebrows I use like always very sharp brown pencils in different shades. Her lips I first color with red soft pastels and then later after sealing I will add all kinds of highlights and color accents with my pencils. Then I add a little bit of eyeshadows to her lids and to her eyeline I add a touch of black soft pastels. And then with light color pencils I add highlights to her eyes.
I also draw the teeth and add highlights to the cupid bow thing above her upper lid. Also add some red pencil to her eyebrows, then they will match her hair color. Now I take a very light pencil and apply it to the most highlighted spots of the doll's face. And then I blend it very good with the blending tool. And then I add a touch of silver and golden metallic pastels to the same most highlighted areas. Then with a very sharp black pencil, I draw the bottom eyelashes. Now I take white acrylic paint and add highlights to her eyes. And now I need just to apply the false lashes and to add gloss to her eyes and lips. And her face is ready! And here is my new version of the Disney princess. I think now she looks more alive than she was before, what do you think? And meanwhile, my channel slowly goes to the 50,000 followers. So I think this Ariel doll will become my gift to you in my special giveaway. So follow my next videos to not miss it. And I hope you have enjoyed my doll repaint. And if you do so, please don't forget to put your thumbs up under this video. And of course, subscribe my channel if you are not with us yet. And you want to get more doll repaints every week. And see you ready tomorrow in my new video. Bye!